Hi guys, my name is Hazel of Brown Skin. I'm a stay-at-home mom and part-time reseller. I primarily sell on Poshmark and eBay, but now I've been rotating in ThreadUp, and I also have a small store under a different brand on Shopify. Today I wanted to talk to you about the XO Rachel Jomar collaboration boxes. If you guys don't know about Jomar, I believe they first started as a chain of thrift stores in the Philadelphia area. Um, at the start of this pandemic, they made wholesale boxes available to resellers and I had tried to purchase one but I think they were flooded and overwhelmed so my order was cancelled so this is actually my first purchase from them and I was so excited because everything was great. Yeah prep and get ready for Q4, increase my inventory across all platforms I'm active on. And well, this box, it came with mostly new with tags, one or two new without tags, but I received 21 pieces instead of 20. So the total cost of the box was $191.25. I'm looking at my notes right here. I don't know if you can see it. But uh, so I received 21 pieces instead of 20 and that made each cost of goods $9.11. So let's dig right in. Let me know what you guys think. So when I first opened the box, I saw a pair of Joe's round sunglasses. Excuse my nails. <laughs> Joe's round sunglasses. Can you see that? So these are new with tag. I'm not sure how much they resell for, but I've sold a Joe's purse before and Joe's jeans, so um, I'm happy with them. They're a good summer item. And I received another pair of Niwa Tags Joe's sunglasses. These are aviators, the style I prefer. <laughs> Gold like a coin purse envelope wallet from Sandro I hope I'm pronouncing that right let me know <laughs> oh and it comes with its own dust bag Sandro okay it's really cute yeah I was looking for a price tag but I didn't find one so this would be new without tag I believe since all of these items are supposed to be new with tag um oh this is cool so i also received these minnetonka suede red boots with all the fringe screaming festivals unfortunately no festivals right now but this would be a good pickup for whoever gets it okay so i know this there's a sensor here but thankfully i had bought one of those heavy duty magnets and I can easily remove that okay so these are a size 6 super cute okay so this is a Sandro kind of a pleated uh, midi dress looks very business casual there is a pen mark that I just noticed on this, but that can be removed. So probably just clean that part. Um, it's new with tags and it had has a retail value of 445. So I never sold this brand before. So we'll see how that goes. I still have to do a lot of research on some of these brands, but I just want to show you. And if you guys are interested in any of these items before I put them up, please, the best way to contact me is through Instagram. And my Instagram handle is at brownskin17. I couldn't get <laughs> just brownskin without 17, but it matches my Poshmark name. Anyways. Um... So this is a sleep shirt by Free People, and it's new with tags, retails for $98. $98 for a sleep shirt? All right. <laughs> Here you go. So it's a nice sleep shirt. 
I love the patterns. Well, it will be available in my Poshmark closet for less than $98, I assure you. <laughs> the box was said to come with three bralettes and these are so cute. So this one is Free People. It's a nice lacy dark green, forest green maybe. And ooh. We got this pretty maroon lace piece. New with tags. Oh wow, this this is so pretty. A nice muted pink bralette. Also new with tags. Free people. I love selling free people. Um, they actually get a lot more on ThreadUp, but I really need more items in my closet because like I mentioned earlier, I'm trying to build my inventory for Q4. So these would be good fillers. This is Intimately by Free People. It's a nice island, tropical, casual pants. What size is this? I might want to keep it size medium. Not yet. <laughs> But it's so hard. Do you guys have any of that problem keeping uh, your inventory? I'm supposed to sell sell them, but they're too cute. All right. So this is ooh a free people bag, a nice little tote. It has a really cute print inside. The outside is corduroy, like a corduroy material. Would be nice for the fall. Free people, new with tags. Sandro, this is another Sandro piece. Oh, I love it. So it is a nice boho tee, tie front. So you gotta tie the front. This is another intimately free people. It looks like it's inside out. Um, they look like pajama pants, but you know, you can wear them in quarantine when you're lounging around the house. I like this. Oh, wow. Okay. So I just realized this is a bodysuit, a very pretty floral bodysuit, um, by Intimately Free People and looks like has some, it's off the shoulders with some tie front detail. That's nice. And this is, wow, a really good wardrobe staple. It is a Sandro blouse. It is so soft and it's new with tag. It is a really nice uh, button down white shirt, new with tags. And this is a Maj, I hope I'm pronouncing it right, French brand, Maj, um, new with tags, just a regular knit t-shirt, but such beautiful jeweled colors for fall. So this is like my first haul I'm filming on YouTube. I hope I'm holding up the shirts right. I'll get this situated, first of many. <laughs> Gotta work out these kinks. Ooh, I like this. This is, oh, okay. This is another Maj shirt. And this has gold embroidered palm trees. Island girl, forever at heart. I love me some palm trees. There you go. I'm trying to hide my nose. <laughs> but it's a simple white tee. Um, this seems to be new without tags. Okay, and then I got this hat, this bucket hat. Uh, it's not Burberry, it's Sandro. <laughs> but that's pretty cool. Someone could use it. Oh, it retails $110. Mm -hmm. oh. And I got this Maj belt. 
It's a Thai belt, Thai boho belt. Feels a little like suede. I don't know, what's an elegant way to hold up a belt? <laughs> we'll have to figure something out with that. Okay, so mine came with two new in-box free people shoes. Yay! You can see right here. So this is the Remy platform in red. I will open it up. But that box is really nice. I like how I suppose three people packages this stuff. Ooh, with that chunky heel. Someone is gonna love it. The last item that was in my Jomar box is another free people box shoe. And this is the Lana Block Heel in red. So this is the Lana heel, a little bit of height, chunky in a patent leather, really bright red. And it comes covered so I guess it won't get stuffed up. So just to recap, I purchased the Joe Mar Rachel collaboration box, all new with tags, new without tags. I had 21 pieces, making each piece $9.11. Okay guys, so thank you for watching. Please let me know down below in the comments what you thought of my first haul video. Um, I'm always looking to improve. And also let me know what you thought of this box and of Jomar in general. And I guess any other comments you want to leave, I would greatly appreciate it. Also subscribe for more videos and hit the thumbs up if you like this video. Thank you. See you guys later.